First of all, the guy that they based Norman Dale on was a guy named Marvin Wood. He is a legend in the state of Indiana uh, as a basketball coach. He ended up coaching in at, in college. He died in 1999. He was not brought in because he couldn't get a job anywhere else. Okay, but he did actually replace a beloved coach. Uh, the the guy that he replaced was a guy named Herman Snort Grinstead. Love that name. Herman, old Snort Grinstead, right? Bobby Plump, who is the real life Jimmy Chitwood, actually said that Coach Grinstead was the most popular coach in Milan's history. The real high school is Milan, Milan, Indiana, the Milan Indians. Okay, so Marvin Wood comes in. This guy, Homer Grinstead, he didn't die. He was fired for ordering new uniforms without the superintendent's orders. Okay, so this this small little high school is tied deeply in with the, with the city, and they have a, obviously a superintendent of the schools. And I guess they had to approve every purchase. And old Snort decided he's going to order new uniforms, not tell anybody. So they fired him over. It. They bring in this guy named Marvin Wood. Marvin Wood was in his second season, not his first season, when he did this. And the idea of a small school and of course at this time they only had one division at the idea of this small school winning a state title wasn't even that far off in 54 because in his first season Marvin Wood actually led them to the semifinals where they lost so they didn't win the state championship they go back in 54 now Bobby Plump did not sit out half the season in protest of Snort being fired Snort wasn't dead he was alive very much alive and Marvin Wood was not a an older guy. He was actually a rather young guy. And Angelo Pizzo said that the reason that he made him old in the movie was because that was a better character. So Marvin Wood being a young guy, if he had failed, this is, this is a quote from Pizzo, it says, if he had failed, he still had the rest of his life. I went back and made the character older, a guy with a last chance. It was an element of the movie they wanted to create, okay? So that's why they made him old, and Marvin Wood was not old. In fact, Marvin Wood was nothing like Norman Dale in terms of how he coached. The coaching aspect, the the fiery temper, right, yelling at referees, the strict practices, that was based after Bobby Knight. So Norman Dale was inspired by Bobby Knight. In fact, the four-pass rule, pass four times before you shoot, that's a Bobby Knight thing. It's not a Marvin Wood thing. It's a Bobby Knight thing. So Bobby Knight did that at University of Indiana. He had passed the ball four times before he shoot. So Marvin Wood, who would go on to become, he would be in the Indiana State uh, High School Hall of Fame. Marvin Wood was nothing like uh, Gene, uh, Gene Hackman's character, Norman Dale. He didn't have a romantic relationship with one of the teachers. He actually was married for decades to one woman, and they had several kids. And and they asked her later about it. And she said, well, the only thing I ever thought he would leave me for is basketball. Kind of joked about it. She like, basketball was more important to him than anything else. And she always thought that was his first love anyway. So that's Marvin Wood. Marvin Wood, nothing like Norman Dale other than the fact that he coached a small little town into the state high school championship. 